Basking in the glory of a successful moon landing, India's space agency ISRO is all set for a further leap into the cosmos. This time India is eyeing the sun. On the 2nd of September, PSLV C-57 rocket will blaze into the skies carrying Aditya L-1. India's sun mission will reach its operational position after an over 120-day voyage. It will get there by performing a complex series of orbits around the Earth, so-called slingshot gravity assist maneuvers that help save propellant. The same technique used for ISRO's Moon and Mars missions. The spacecraft is planned to be placed in a halo orbit around Lagrangian point one of the Sun-Earth system, which is about 1.5 kilometers from the Earth, where it will remain for about five years observing our star. But why spend so much time and energy going close to the Sun? The spacecraft will be carrying seven payloads to observe the Sun's outermost layers. From time to time, the Sun is shaken by violent eruptions. Hot jets of plasma shoot from the surface as the sun's intense inner motion disturbs its magnetic field lines. Waves are sent through the atmosphere hundreds of thousands of kilometers high and at temperatures rising to 100 million degrees. While NASA and the European Space Agency have previously placed orbiters to study the sun, it will be the first such mission for India. Going by the distance and the experiments, Aditya L1 mission is a complex and challenging task, but it has the potential to provide valuable insights into the Sun and its impact on the Earth. Bureau Report, Beyond World is One.